meaning of exchanges, I mean, it's exchanges, partnership, collaboration uh, between uh, a different level. Uh, at the level of uh, clinician together with scientists, with different expertise, uh, at the level of the patients themselves, uh, who uh, participate to the research, uh, at the level of uh, the politician, because scientists and clinicians are, are providing evidences to the, to the, the politician. It's always difficult to convince politicians, especially uh, when they see that uh, it will be a, an economical impact. So the reason why it's so important to exchange also with the representative of patients and in the field of HIV AIDS, uh, the activists have been wonderful to make pressure on uh, the decision makers. Uh, has been wonderful to make pressure on the private sector, on uh, the pharma, to reduce the price of the treatment. So for me, exchanges is to have this network of people working together. And sometimes uh, activists are, are calling us uh, and exchanging with us because they need a scientific evidence to convince the policy makers. It's a very difficult situation for, for a young scientist, especially these days, uh, because uh, according to uh, the international evaluation system, uh, they need to have a leadership. To have a leadership, they think that uh, it's easier if you don't have too many collaboration with others in order to publish as a first author in the best journal in order to make a, a, a career. This is certainly uh, the best way at individual level for it's making a career, but they will not make a, a Nobel it's Prize. I was not a good student at all. I was not a good student because after one year at university I could not find out what was the link between what I was learning at the university and what I was expecting uh, from uh, research or, or science. So the reason why after the second year I, I decided, which was really unusual at that time in, in my country, in France, uh, to try to find a laboratory that will accept uh, that I will work part-time in the lab and the remaining time to continue my study at university. So it's really at that point when I found the laboratory uh, because at that point I understood what I was learning at the university was important for my goal. So one solution should be to be on the field, let's say, very early on to understand better what is the aim of uh, becoming a scientist. I would love to see a, one next Nobel Prize coming from a researcher, maybe a clinical researcher from the developing world. That will be wonderful.